time using the camera. <laughs> hey everybody! We're going on an adventure today and we want to take you along with us. So, we're actually going to a fall festival slash car show. And if you've been here a while, you know that we've tried a few car shows and didn't uh, enjoy them. Lame. <laughs> um, but it actually came about in a, a roundabout way. Um, there's something I want to look at on Marketplace that was quite a distance away. So we decided to make a day of it and see what we could find that was going on. And it just happens that there's a car show and fall festival, so we're going to give it a try. But it's a little different because we're not taking the Jeep this time. We're taking this beast. Does it have a name? Why don't we name this thing? Does not have a name. Does not have a name. So I we are. the red truck. The red truck. So we are working on coming up with a name. Let us know if you have any ideas. Our camper it doesn't technically have a name, but I want to name it Eleanor um, because of the Beatles song, Eleanor Rigby. It's a 1966 and that's when that uh, camper and song came out. So I think Eleanor is an adorable name, but I don't know if I'm going to win on that. So we need names for this big truck. And let's just see how the truck show, the car show goes with the truck. Play ball. So I, I always think that. What are you doing? 
I'm just relaxing. It's a beautiful day with my favorite people. It is nice under all these trees. in an 87 Ford truck, B3500. Winner, winner, chicken First dinner. place, Robert Callahan in the 20th. All right, just want to show you what beats have. I know. We, we're happy. One second place. It was a fun day, but... Happy family! I don't know. There's nothing you unique. Put that camera away and tell me which way to go now. Oh yeah, okay. <laughs> Bye. We just stopped here at Walmart for a minute. Oh, there she is. And there's a Goodyear blimp. I watch this. I'm gonna scare her. Hey, there's a blimp. Just had to. Yeah, we all had to. You just had to. I really was just showing you the blimp, and I'm like, wait, I got a horn, I got a girl, I got a camera. You got me. Magic. Every time. And voila. Happy. Boom <laughs> goes the dynamite. Oh, wait, now you can really see it. Yeah. It's a good year for blimps. That's really far away, though. Sorry, guys. It's the best I can do. Do you know another word for a blimp? Uh, no, I I know it. A airboat. Starts with a Z. Airboat sounds good. Yeah, Zeppelin. It looks now, like a boat. Someone on YouTube will probably tell me I'm wrong. I think there's a difference <laughs> between a blimp and a Zeppelin, but I don't know what it is. Close enough. All right, ready? Go ready. home. Let's roll. I don't know. Does it keep blinking? Yeah, it works. Oh, I thought I, I was waiting. We've had this camera for three years. I was waiting for it to stop blinking. <laughs> what are you laughing at? I know that. Okay, anyway. Remember, this whole trip started because I found something I wanted on Marketplace, right? So, we just picked it up. We got it. It's in the trunk. Well, Bed. Tail bed. Tail bed. Tailgate. I don't know if you can see it. Oh, there. I think you could a little bit. We got ourselves a propane fireplace. Fire pit. Out, outdoor fire pit. I should not. Can I sign this video <laughs> I don't over? think. I think we should let Scarlett be in charge. I'm kidding. Anywho. <laughs> We love having campfires and we'll still have our regular wood fires too, but um, sometimes... We want like fire, have fire for 20 minutes and then we want to go inside and watch Netflix. Exactly. <laughs> sometimes we don't do it because it's kind of like a whole process and get the fire going and 
so we were thinking if we had one that we can just turn on, it would be that much easier and we might use it more. So we're gonna set it up when we get home and can't wait to use it. How are you feeling, Mr. Winner? Uh, just trying to merge on the interstate without getting run over. Good idea. Gotta pay attention. How are you, pumpkins? Good. I feel like a pumpkin. You feel like a pumpkin? Yes. My guts are very twisted. Oh. I am pumpkin. You are pumpkin based. said incorrectly that it was a fireplace a fireplace so it's fire pit propane one but we've been looking for one and these things are like two to four hundred bucks or more right yes and we found this one on marketplace they had two of the exact same ones it's brand new boxes beat up but uh like it's very new <laughs> we paid what we pay 125 bucks for. Yep. Yeah. So that's pretty good, I think. Hopefully, as it's long like, as it works. Hopefully, and it's everything. in here. What if they just I put know. like rocks? In that here? would be really mean. That would be a dirty trick. <laughs> <laughs> Did that scare you? No. Some good styrofoam. Wow. We can use that for something. Yeah. Don't let Charlotte see. Actually, styrofoam's annoying. It's hard to get rid of. Oh. All right, stay tuned. We'll unwrap this and okay, we'll be back. See what's next. We're, trying to, we're having a debate. Once you get it, I might. It'd probably be best farther. if I just do it myself, actually. Oh, burn! <laughs> trying to figure Once out you get who's it smaller. Down farther, I or can probably do it. Who's stronger, Scarlett, mm. Saul, or Andrea? Hmm. Clearly me. It's I, a debate. I think. I mean, she outweighs you by like. Watch pounds. your words. I like 12 pounds. So, <laughs> so I weigh 78. She weighs. I don't know. 280? You're, two, you're skinny. I, I was thinking more like 320. Wow. Okay. Anyhow, <laughs> this thing's not super heavy, but it's kind of awkward and I don't want to drop it. So. Alright. As soon as she's done, I'm, I'm mowing down some in. cornbread. I was they hungry. can't see you. And under here, mm -hmm. I think you can handle some of this. Oh! Ah. Uh -oh. What? Oh, that's the cord. Okay. I could probably do this. I think you could. Watch the dog. She's. <laughs> I can't She's... see her. Here, let's turn it that way so you're not walking backwards. You okay? Yeah. You you said... the awesome. the that wasn't too bad. Not bad at all. All right. Turn the camera around and, and tell them what's happening here. <laughs> what's happening? We're getting our fire pit in order. No, tell them what's really oh, happening. What's really happening is I am terrible with tech stuff. stuff. Apparently the record button is too much for me. She does it backwards. When she wants to record, she stops recording. <laughs> and when she's done, she hits record. So I was, I thought recording them putting the lava rocks in, but I wasn't. You were. Oops. Anyway, we were discussing how um, we just assumed the propane tank would go in this giant bowl and be hidden, but it doesn't actually fit. So we're not sure if it's meant to go in there um, and ours is just too big, but I don't know. For now, we have this kind of eyesore of a cord and propane tank that will have to sit out here on the patio. but. We'll deal with it, it's no big deal. Um, and maybe we'll look into seeing if we can get a smaller propane tank that would go underneath. Cause it is hollow, so I'm hoping it's just as, needs to be a smaller one. But I'm excited, we get to use our fire pit tonight. Were you recording that time? I hope. <laughs> All right, Me should too. we try it? We should. Are you recording? Oh, you look so 
Yeah. Like if you scratch you that like plastic, it? it probably turns yeah, white or like something. Yeah, it's like real lava. I know. It's pretty neat, huh? Very neat. Off. Light. Uh, I am a little nervous, like, don't, please don't let it blow up in my face. Like, I'm standing In back. anyone's face. All right, so you got to turn, it's like a pilot light. You have to turn it and push it in. And then <laughs> do it. It's working. It's working. Oh, it's so cool. We have fire. A lot easier when you read the instructions fire. on this. Why are men so against instruction? Because we just know how to do everything naturally. Exactly. I can't help that someone made this wrong. <laughs> Use a machete. I just pick it up. I know what to do. Yeah. No. No, you don't. It's beautiful. All right, so let's let it warm up. Okay. And get some chairs and party. Okay. Okay. I get a little snack, maybe. Oh, and it's actually like warm, yeah, generating heat. Up. We're doing it. We're so happy by our fire. We're just sitting out here, you know, with a good old cup of chips, <laughs> as we do here in Pennsylvania. Sitting by our fire. What do you think? I like it. Nice and toasty. It'll be nice because we won't have to do that every time. <laughs> I was thinking that still took less time than it would to make a good fire. Making a regular yeah. fire. Yeah. So let me give you. A, perspective it's it's big it's 38 inches or 39 inches across pretty big. i'm pretty stoked for 125 bucks brand new yeah um i think it is big and then people said they got rid of it because they got a bigger the one bigger one yeah I'm like whoa all right we are going to end the video here we're going to make some s'mores finish our cup of chips and that's a wrap for Thanks the day. Thanks for coming with us on our adventure day. Yeah. We didn't know what we were getting into exactly. Yeah, it was a different day, but it was fun it was to get fun. out. It was fun. We went somewhere different. And I think that was one of the best car shows we've been yeah, to. Yeah, we usually don't love them, but that one was pretty pleasant. It was very pleasant. And you won! Yeah. Which is awesome. That always makes it better. And I won in the fire pit world. Yep. So now we're going to just chill. So until next time. Catch you later. Catch you later. Bye. Tessie? No.